today we are going to discuss about what is language and the relation with cognition it is stated that the language is uh, the cognition is uh, based upon the language the cognitive processes are developed by language development so today we are analyzing it what is first of all we will uh, learn what is cognitive development what do you mean by cognitive development cognitive development means uh, the cognitive development refers to internal process and product of the mind leading to knowledge development it's an internal process and the product of mind internal process means there are various process in your mind that's memorizing remembering thinking etc are here highlighting here and the product of the mind is you know the marks etc so it covers a wide aspect of mental activity so it covers a wide aspects that's memorizing categorizing and symbolizing memorizing means memorize anything which you know which you learned it helps the language helps in memorizing them okay next is categorizing in order to categorize what is what you learned the language helps for the development of this categorizing symbolizing you know it's a thing that the language is language the letter in the language is simple then problem solving and creativity the problem solving and creativity is the cognitive development aspect but it is related to language development and the thing is inventions the inventions are also done through the cognitive process product it's a product of the cognitive cognition dreaming and fan fantasy dreaming is another thing that we dream our dream is based upon our cognitive as well. dream is a cognitive aspect it's stated by sigmund freud in his uh, uh, in his idea in his psychological idea he stated the dreaming is a part of the cognitive development next one is reading and writing reading and writing is also a cognitive development process then it's proved that cognition and language has a relation that means without language cognitive development will not happen next one is language language acquisition language is acquired on the basis of cognition it has opposite relation also the language develops cognition and cognitive aspect is related to language it's a thing language and cognition just we are going to analyze it humans are not born with language but they learn with our over time all the humans are uh, born but without the language they didn't know what to see what is uh, seeing and how it is pronouncing but they learn with over time it is based upon their cognitive aspect as our mind learn language the language creates a framework that allows our mind to form consistent and con conscious thoughts we have a consistent and conscious thought it's based upon the language the language makes a frame out for it next one is language allows our mind to process the information in consistent way in a consistent way in order to make our language make our uh, cognitive aspect in a consistent way we need a language more language we learn the faster our mind may be able to work that's the thing that how more uh, you learn the language aspect 
Foster will be your mind works and cognitive development will be foster. Uh, we have some examples like uh, uh, small children is crying their cognitive aspect on the basis of language first of all they learn language and uh, after their cognitive process is starting helps for effective way for respond to various situation it helps to uh, if it have, uh, it helps to respond in an effective way based upon the situation that's a problem solving help to think think in image it helps the mind to interrupt and res reasonable information right written language is converted system of image already i stated it the written language is the converted system of image in your mind so the converted system of image image is developed through thinking that's the relationship between language and cognitive language has important role in memory and thinking in order to make proper memorization and thinking we need language helps to transfer of thoughts from one mind to another in order to transfer idea from one mind to another we need a language then only we have to develop our mind uh, from making communication with each other if communication is better we have our thinking will grow thoughts came first while language expression of it language is expressing it but thoughts came first by language we have we, have, we can express the idea it's a chart of uh, cognition and uh, language you can see that uh, cognition is related to language cognition means perception action social communication culture body experience emotions etc these all are based upon language these all are packed up with language so cognition and language has a good connection it's also a, um, a chart based upon language and cognition cognitive aspect in language description of abstract thoughts uh, uh, it's starting from below actually starting from below sensory motor signal first of all it's a cognitive process but in it language process is sensory motor language model that's language sound sound is uh, at the uh, early stage children make different sounds it's a signal learning it's based upon signal learning it's a cognitive aspect but sensory motor language model is there uh, the language has a connection with uh, the memory aspects next one is word for object words are formed by seeing the objects cognition t part, part is the object the learn about object but it's formed as words in language next phrases for situations uh, next stages uh, they use language on the basis on the uh, situation based upon the situation the situation is the uh, process of the mind it's a problem solving technique it's a uh, some cognitive process it's based upon the phrases it's uh, supported by phrases situation and phrases it's language one last one language descriptions of abstract thought after it there will be abstract thought the abstract idea is the cognitive process but abstract word phrase is the language process abstract idea is based on language abstract phrases so language and cognition has very very big connection so it's a, a research part is there is a connection between language and cognition the research is uh, the researchers are looking for uh, new ideas from the language and cognition connection of language and cognition cognition in our mind so that's all in this class we will see another part in another class thank you for hearing me